Right now at 6, game over. A business busted for illegal gambling. Authorities say a vape business in a rural community was doing a lot more than selling an alternative to smokes. Thanks for being with us tonight. This major bust for Isle of Wight went down about three hours ago. Now, but the investigation has been going on for months. Authorities raided Wicked Vapes on Carrollton Boulevard. The business has been there for a year and has been under suspicion that gambling has been going on for a while. Ten on your side, Jason Marks broke this story on Twitter and has more on this developing story. It was about 2.30 when that raid took place. Deputies tell us they have been watching this business since early summer and they believe what's going on in there is illegal gambling. Gambling is illegal. In Isle of Wight, deputies say that's exactly what's been happening inside this business for months. Since this business opened up, it opened up for the sole purpose of running the, the gambling operation in the back of the store. The business along Carrollton Boulevard has no signs, but it's called Wicked Vapes. We've got some complaints from some of the surrounding business owners and some of the residents here in Carrollton about the, the traffic in and out of this building, especially at late night hours. That's when deputies began looking into the business. They spent months undercover playing the slot type games on the 39 computers. It's very clearly people are going in here, they're exchanging money for a chance to play these games. They're playing, they're coming out with cash in hand. Everything will now be seized. Deputies also raided the business owner's home on Nelson, Maine, just down the road. We're told she took out the business license for the vape shop about a year ago. People come here not to buy the vapes. They're coming here to um, participate in this gambling and these, these gaming operations. So far, no one has been charged. Deputies tell us the next thing they're doing is seeing if this business owner has similar businesses here in Hampton Roads. That's the latest here in Isle of Wight County. Jason Marks, 10 on your side.